the broken sky. Let's get right into it. There we go. Final stretch. Yeah, you know, it's... Uh, sort of, right? Sort of final stretch? It's been a long time coming. Yeah, I think we can do it. Um, Is it a grown-ass woman who's voicing that little girl? Yeah, like 100%. Yeah. It's, that's kind of oh. creepy, right? I'm just look at her, dude. She's a monster. Yeah. They they so. really do like to sexualize their little girls and um. Yeah, dude. Like she has hear? like like she has adult person features, right? Yeah, dude. Her face is is an adult. The proportions are all wrong, but it's, um. Yeah. Did you hear Correct. news about the fighting game community, like FGC and Evo? No. Oh, it, it's a mess right now, dude, apparently. Um, I was listening to it in a podcast, and apparently there's, like, uh, like a lot of, like, like child-banging allegations going surrounding... What? Yeah, surrounding the, um, uh, what is it, like, soup, uh, Smash, ter Smash Tournament thing? Like, like the players or the... Yeah, like, like the organizers, like, banging kid players and stuff. Because, like, Smash, you know, it's a Nintendo game. It brings in the young yes, audiences. Yes, 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 yes. Yeah, a lot of, like, um, taking advantage of underage kids and stuff. Like, it's, what? it's pretty gross. And Evo is not happening this year as a result. Because, like, the, the commentators and things are all like, Yo, fuck this. I'm not, I'm not being a part of this anymore. And, um... I don't blame them. That's fucked. Yeah, exactly. It's all kind of, kind of in a bad place right now. Yikes. Yeah, 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 yeah. So that's how we're starting today's session with child bang yeah, so allegations. All right, let's uh, get right into this. Speaking of that, back to this little girl in Bayonetta. Yeah, 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 yeah. Exactly, exactly. Um, wow. She just explained that the glasses aren't magic, but. Uh, Ezio here still can't see the the angels. Um, Maybe you have to believe you can see the angels. You must believe there is no spoon. <laughs> there is no spoon, Neo. Um, there are no cookies either. Aren't there? They're the still Oracle? delicious. Oracle bakes cookies, yeah. But there are no cookies, Jay. True. I mean, much like Cypher's eating that fake digital steak, right? Yeah, I mean, I need... Speaking of that, I'm gonna eat this mochi now. God green tea mochi. damn it. This Fuck. episode brought to you by... I don't know the brand, but it's it's green tea mochi that came in a box, so... Is it the kind that has ice cream inside, or does it have the no, red no, no, bean no. inside? No, it's got, like, red bean. Ah, good. That's a good good. That's a good yeah, good. That's the OG good. Uh-huh. It's got all kinds of fucking, like, flour, what? like, coating it, though. It's like... Oh, real, is it, is it like a, a clear plastic wrap, and then there's, like, a white circle, like, cardboard piece on the bottom? No, 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 no. Oh. It's coming in, like, just little, little, like, almost, like, cupcake holder things. I don't know, but... Oh. Dude, oh, my God. God damn it, dude. <laughs> what? Dude, there must be hella, like, Korean bakeries around you, eh? Well, I guess in K-Town, it's, it's just... It came from 99 Ranch Market, bro. So it's a Chinese mochi? Yeah, it is a Chinese mochi. Well, no, it's Japanese mochi, but they sold it at a Chinese place. Mm. Which is generally how it goes. Right. Makes sense. That's good, though, dude. Man, listen, all man. the Asian, Asian culture is just... Uh, exploiting Japanese stuff. Hey, to make listen. Money. Now we can. Now we can like add a ASMR tag to our video. No, I no, no. Uh, as a matter of no. fact, I'm just gonna cut out all of your lip smacks. Don't you fucking do it, dude. Finally, hear my lip. Finally, hear my entirely. Yep. I'm gonna upload an entire just video of me making lip smacking sounds then to our channel. You can uh, mm, mm, make your own channel called. Uh, <laughs> Mitchell McLipsmax. Mitchell McLipsmax. Uh, <laughs> and, uh... You gotta maybe... give me one. Yeah, I gotta... Me... Alright. Give me three seconds of Lipsmax in this video. Three seconds. Oh, God. Alright, starting right now. Alright. And stop. Alright. <laughs> God. You're welcome. 
You're welcome, nobody, because everyone hey, I'm just revolutionizing left. the Let's Play world, man. <clears throat> who does? Who mixes ASMR with Let's Play? I mean, everyone with a decent microphone, I guess, and a sultry voice. I don't. I don't know. Yes, sort of, I guess, but. Ah, uh, it's a good Friday. I'm happy. Um, You're happy. I'm pretty That's happy, good. dude. It's uh, so. Weekend vibes. Weekend vibes. Nice. Already had some, uh, some Crown Royal and. Ah. Uh, oh. Yeah. Yeah. I got, I got Miles coming over later tonight, and we're gonna smoke a cigar and uh, drink some Lafroig Scotch. Whoa! Did <clears throat> did Miles move to LA or something? Yeah, a while ago. Whoa. Yeah. Is is he the um? Just what I needed, guy, or, or whatever. It is. Yeah, he. Wait, how'd you know about that shit? You guys do it all the time. Just what, what I needed. I needed. <laughs> yeah, I hear that shit all the time from you guys. Oh, yep, that's him. So is was that like part of a play or a musical? I mean, we never say that around him because he gets very self-conscious of it. But we oh. make fun of it all the time together Good. without him. Good. <laughs> Good. <laughs> As any good friend should. Yeah, yeah. No, it's from like a musical theater class we all took. And, and he sang a song. And I think it was called Just What I Needed. And that's how he sang it. And Whoa! Was it like everyone was laughing at him or something? Y'all getting nuked. Um... No, we weren't, we weren't. It was just... It wasn't, like, funny, it was just... Memorable, you know? Okay. Because it was hilarious? <laughs> it was funny, yeah. It was... But it was also good, like, he did a good job, but, like... Oh. I don't know, man. I'm trying to compare it to something, and, like... It's like sometimes, like it's like a reference, like in a movie. Sometimes there's some really like iconic things that happen, and they're not necessarily funny, but you just feel, you just quote them anyways, and it okay, becomes okay. funny because oh. you're quoting it out of context. It's a life reference. Yeah, that's that's what Li life reference. Uh huh. Okay. Okay. Sometimes hey, things are funnier after the fact when you're like. Yeah. Hey, by the way, we're we're on an airship now. Oh, airship level. Airship level. Bang, wow. and, and there's stuff, oh, yep. Oh my and god, whoa, was that your weave? Nope, that's another weave. Whose weave is that? Who who else has weaves? Oh, blonde lady? Yeah, it's kind of like white hair, you? but, yeah. Huh. It's been a while, but I think, I think I can handle these basic pictures. Oh damn, just tossing them around with your hair? Yeah. Oh, it's a red hot shot. I can come back to life if I lose all my health. Oh. All oh. right. Does it automatically like get used? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. It's just a one up. Yep. Exactly. Oh. Okay. Did it, did it just get used right there? No, no. Oh, okay. <laughs> that would be pretty uh I was thinking that, but uh, yeah, no. <laughs> He's uh, he's a not like a dad. These oh. Japanese games all kind of have similar environments. Yeah. You know they they know what's exciting. Oh, uh, bang, yeah. bang. Okay, all right. Oh, oh, whoa, whoa! This whoa, reminds me of whoa. X X two. Oh. Uh, X X Men, X -Men oh, no, two. X, X yeah X two. What's it called? X two Wolverine. X two. Like X Men Two or Wolverine? Yeah, X Men like... Two. Just X Men Two. Oh. Isn't there a subtitle? Uh, I, I La don't know. No, I mean... the third one's Last Stand. X Men Two. Yes, I know that much. X Men Two. I All swear right, it had a subtitle, right? Gonna look it up. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. Or it was just X Two. I might have to look it up. But uh, I wouldn't really know. Oh no, it's just called X2. What the? It's just called... Oh, X2 X-Men United. Dude, yeah, okay. I was thinking it was something United, but I thought that was the third one. 
Because that makes sense. That's right? X Men X Three Last Stand. Right, right, right. Anyways, there's a scene where they're like, everyone falls out of like a airplane, and then Nightcrawler has to do some crazy teleporty shit to mm. retrieve everybody and get them back on the plane. That's what that reminded me of. So Got it. Go. Kind of like Iron Man, right? Where he saves the people on the airplane. Yeah, kind of like that too. Yeah, that was cool. I like those yeah. scenes in movies. Spider Man well, does that, I think, in some, some, some one of his films. Nah, Spider Man did the, the subway thing. Oh where yeah. Where he, yeah, he yeah. does the face, you know. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he, do, he does the he, meme I face. I mean, if we're talking about Raimi Spider Man, then he does a lot of faces. Tobey Maguire. Yeah, does yeah. The best Tobey Maguire. Yeah. Faces, yeah. Exactly. Or Tobey Maguire is like. Um, I like the crying face he does too. That's probably face? the most famous. Oh. There's this part in Spider Man 1 where uh, he's fighting Green Goblin at the end. Mm. And he, Green Goblin like throws him against the wall or something and he makes this like girly whining sound. He's like, oh! <laughs> like, it's, <laughs> no, it's great. Yeah, um, Toby. Never changed, Toby. Yeah, yeah. Although apparently he was like people say he was pretty full of himself after that and got really cocky and kind of like became an asshole, which is kind of upsetting. <sighs> okay, I mean, it was like the first like not even Marvel but like superhero film to like really make it, you know? It's to really make it, yeah. I'd yeah. yeah. It, it definitely was, yeah. Yeah. So much so that it inspired a bunch of video games, which were like the first movie video games to really make it yeah yeah like dude spider-man 2 was like fucking was great shit, dude. yeah it was like one of the first like, open world like truly open world games yeah with like good uh web swinging and stuff yeah. it was pretty incredible but um you know good old uh spider-man 3 emo spider-man it's uh good good memories emo spider-man oh i love emo spider-man Mm-hmm. Or he's walking down the street. Doing doing finger guns at everybody. Finger guns and uh, air humps. Yeah, it's great. Yeah, so so Jean is here. Um Jean? Oh Jean, that's right. Yeah. French French witch. Yeah. And uh as always we have to fight. Yep. Oh! Whoa! That was cool. A wanted bullet action? Yeah. <laughs> Yo, got that. Got that sound bite. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Very necessary. Um. See, I guess now is as good as a time as any to uh, finally talk about Linkin Park, huh? Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. So, um, last I night... I begun so hard. What? I can feel you be... Da -da 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 -da. Right. be less like me. So last night, I was, uh, <laughs> I was like, going to bed. Just in case you, you guys know. hadn't heard of Linkin Park, I was just doing that. Okay, that's, that's it. Sure. But um I was uh watching YouTube before bed as is uh normal, right? And uh as is tradition? Yeah, I saw a recommendation was like in the end music video, <laughs> right? Yeah. And uh have you seen the in the end music video? Uh probably it's I don't remember it though. Awful. Oh. It's pretty bad, dude. It's like Chester is like in a edgelord tower and there's a gargoyle there in the desert and like Mike Shinoda is like in the desert and he's rapping and then like sometimes oh my god what are you what are you doing god we're gonna get copyright struck dude <laughs> what but I was, I was playing that I'm allowed to play piano in my videos yeah fair fair <laughs> but, uh, uh, Mike Shinoda's in the desert uh -huh. there's like uh, plants growing around him also there's like a, a whale flying around like by the tower that Chester's in and it's all just horrible CG and I'm like this is this is bad like in the chorus they're like 
you know, all on top of the tower and stuff. It, it's not great. Um, yeah, I was like, th this is this is pretty bad. I mean, and I've seen some other like Linkin Park music videos, and those were pretty horrible. So, really, well, yeah, okay, a lot of them are bad. Maybe the standard is that they're not great, but like breaking the habit is like incredible. It's like the anime music video. Breaking the habit. Yeah. You know that song. Yeah, yeah. What is, what's in the music video? It's an a it's a it's an anime music video, but like official, and like it's it's fucking awesome. Oh. Have you have you not seen the Breaking the Habit uh, music video? No, I haven't. Bruh. I I will immediately send it to you after this. What time? Um, uh, I already got it. I already got pulled up. I'll watch it after this. Yeah, it's it's straight up. You know, like when anime music videos were big, the AMV uh -huh. thing. Sure. It's literally that, but it's an official music video, and it's it's great. And I'm like, how did In the End happen with this like also being a thing? <laughs> like what? I guess they, maybe they just didn't have like a clear direction with, with where they wanted to go with music videos. Yeah, probably yeah. Just, they were probably just asked by the record label to do them, and right. I mean, I think In the End was from their debut album, whereas Meteora was in was where Breaking the Habit is from. So like, right. I haven't listened to them in a while. I mean, I used to be a huge Linkin Park fan, though. Yeah, dude, same. As you should be, because, I mean, Linkin Park's like great. I like, RIP, that. I like that most more recent song by that Chester did. Hmm. What was that? I don't know. Some I didn't really song listen. He wrote about struggling with depression or something. That's like all of them, practically, though. That's true. That's a good yeah. point. Mike Shinoda was like OG, like cool Asian guy. Kinda, yeah. Cool American I, Asian guy, at least. Yeah. I guess he'd be like your... the person that you relate to, because he's, he's half, right? Uh, yeah, kind of, yeah. Yeah. It's like him, and like, I liked him a lot, and uh... Keanu Reeves kind of, but Keanu Reeves just kind of like looks white. Most people don't know he's Asian unless they know, you know? Wait, what? He's Keanu Reeves is like a fourth Japanese, yeah. What? That's what I'm saying, dude. Japanese? He's a fourth Japanese, for sure. I, I don't had think no I'm making idea. that up. Let me. Right, I'm gonna confirm just to make sure I'm not making that up. I can see it now that you mention it, but like, I had no idea. Yeah. And that's what makes yeah, him people... being in Matrix so much better. Exactly. Wow. Yeah, like um. Also, I don't know if you noticed, but uh, Jean was just fighting me with a motorcycle. Okay, no, Keanu Reeves' grandma is Chinese Hawaiian. <laughs> That's not Japanese at all. No, it's not Japanese. I was totally wrong. Maybe I just thought Japanese because he does a lot of Japanese-related like stuff. Right, right. But yeah, so it's it's hard to man. People who are a fourth, like you can't really tell. No, all the I time. mean th that's that's a little bit too past the threshold to like I guess so yeah but then again like when people were like a fourth like like black you can totally tell I think yeah okay maybe it's just more dominant like a lot of the features right and like because I feel like Asian she features are pretty dominant I don't know at least they were with me yeah but like half compared to a quarter is, is you know that's true yeah and it was my mom I don't know if that makes a difference yeah I mean I'm pretty I sure like I feel like Asian, like half Asian people whose like fathers were, are Asian usually look more white than like if their moms were. At least mm. in my experience. But Asian men landing a white woman is uh, it's it's more rare. That's true. That's very true. Yeah. It's a more rare situation. But it happens. High five. <laughs> 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 well, you're not even Asian. You're, you're. Yeah, you can go either no, way. But but like, okay, yeah, sure enough, true. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But yeah, no, Keanu Reeves, a little bit Asian, vaguely Asian. Little, little bit Asian. Enough to be like, okay, I mean, more Pacific Islander, really, right? Chinese Hawaiian is Asian, I'd, I'd say. Yeah, but Chinese Hawaiian means that he's just. An eighth Asian. 
No, no. I think if you're Chinese Hawaiian, it's like it means that she's Chinese, but is from Hawaii. No. Like Chinese, what? she's Chinese ethnically, but Hawaiian culturally. Y yeah. Yeah. Right. Like, like if you said Chinese American, it means you're you're Chinese. But in America. America. Oh, okay. Fair so enough. I feel like Chinese Hawaiian is like, cause Hawaii is like, I mean, a lot of like other other Asian influences on Hawaii, other than just like Native Hawaiian. Right. Yeah, Pacific Islander. So like you're kind of yeah. Asian. But I guess I don't know. Yeah, Pacific don't Islander know. is like I don't know. They're like Latino Asian almost. I don't know, man. Uh, uh, that, that's Regardless, the... Keanu Reeves is a little bit Asian. Any yes. way you look at it. Yes. No and denying. so, after I knew that, I was like, there's hope for me becoming an actor. Okay, Sliver. I mean... You know, Brandon Lee was, was my guy. That was gonna be my guy, and then he fucking, uh, like, he fucking prematurely, rest in peace, died. Yeah. Which really sucks, because he was fucking awesome. And that movie, the, the Crow, was fucking sweet. I have never actually seen it, so... Highly recommend you check that shit out. What? Is it actually, like, worth watching? Yes, dude, the crow's sick! What? Oh my god, yes! Dude, Brandon Lee was gonna blow the fuck up after that. I mean, what is it? Is it just, like, vigilante movie? Like, isn't yeah. it kind of like a superhero thing? Like, Yeah, it is, but it's, like, super, like... Dark. Like, stylized right? and dark, yeah. Okay, so kind of like pun Asian Punisher. Kind of, yeah, but but he was like half Chinese and he was super fucking cool and like I don't know, he, it was just awesome. Yeah, and then somebody left like 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 brass shavings in the in the gun that was used, like some. some no, shit like that. so I think it was like no, I think just the casing like like punctured him when when it because it was it, it, they were firing blanks, but I think they shot it like too close to him. Right, right, and, and then the, like the casing the, is like penetrating, but I don't think anything. I don't know. Wait, I, but a, a casing doesn't come out of a barrel, though. So like, the story that I heard is that like something that was filled with like I don't know. Right. The story that I heard is that like the whoever was supposed to be in charge of like handling weapons for the set was not there that day, and like you're supposed to clean the barrel every time you fire uh, a blank because there's like um, there's like material that's left in the barrel. Mm. That can like actually be shot out at bullet speeds, and um, they just never cleaned it. And uh, yeah, he uh, got shot point blank with with like fucking. A, I think it just and it punctured his heart. Yeah, yeah. Like the odds of that happening are so low. I. Yeah, it's it's pretty ridiculous, honestly. But. Uh, but it's, I don't know. It's regardless, tragic and fucking yeah. sucks, man. He was he was right, so. Pete. I mean, and he was so good at martial arts, man. Yeah, I mean, with your dad being who he is, like, Yeah, Christ. right. And I think, I think, you know how, like, the Asians in, like, uh, film and stuff is kind of, like, a cool, like, thing that's happening right now? Yeah, with, like, crazy I feel rich like Asians? This I feel like this would have happened way earlier if he did not die. Hmm. I really do believe that. I mean... Like Bruce Lee and stuff, like, I mean, I mean Jet Li and like Jackie Chan and stuff were there to like, right? But I mean, but I mean age. as like, I mean as like a traditional romantic lead. I think he would have, he would have like paved the way. Hmm. Because hmm. like you don't get Asians in traditional, traditional like romantic leading roles. Uh, I think, like one of the first was Crazy Rich Asians. I think, I, but I, but he would have like done that like, fucking thirty years earlier. Right, right. Okay. I getcha. Hey, we got a bronze award. I mean, that's... It could be worse. Could be worse. Could be one worse. <laughs> you one. are one better than the worst, Jay. Yes, yes. Which you is You are fine. the worst plus one. Uh, so, not, not the worst, so... You're the worst, but just plus one. just say I'm good, dude, and maybe this playthrough will go oh, a, a bit better. I, oh um, my god! Look, it's been long time. It's I guess and so, man. This yeah, like been... 
barely matters. We've been, and we've been busy with... Yeah, you know, we, uh, we've been making moves a little bit here and there. A little bit. But we gotta bit. get back to our Bayo roots, you know? We gotta Bayo... Bayo roots before we get back to the root, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Something like that. So, a little remnant, a little remnant, uh... Yeah. yeah, that's that's our remnant reference. It's a remnant reference. Yeah, what? That's the root. The root. That's like the main no. antagonist in the in remnants thus far. That is. How true. is that not a remnant reference? No, I mean it totally is. But I mean that's oh, yeah. that's all that we're. That's the big one. That's the one. Look out for that. Oh, people. If you say so, dude. It's a cool game. Check it out. It's a cool game. Check it out here on this yeah. channel. <laughs> what? <laughs> hey, hey, this is a channel. Uh, Why are you saying it like a like a pastor? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> you must believe in the channel. channel. <laughs> Dude, 